When you want to line up objects in 3D space, snapping is going to be your best friend. Now let's say for example in this case I want to move this back wall, the blue one, to line up with the back side of the floor. Now of course you can do this by clicking on this Z arrow and then pushing it back. And then maybe you can go to the side view to make sure that this lines up and then you lift it up and so on. Or of course we can use numbers by selecting the layers, then pressing P, then you just work these numbers out. Or you could use snapping. Now snapping is going to be perhaps the easiest and the most effective way of doing this. And for it to work, you need to first have the selection tool selected. And then you click on the layer. And as you drag the layer, if you hold down the control key or command key on the Mac, you'll see that the center of the layer is going to start snapping to the different points of the other layers. Now that's great already. But let's say, for example, you want this point, the base of the blue wall, to snap to the floor. Now that's very easy. All you have to do in order to tell After Effects that this is the point that you want to snap around, you need to go and click somewhere near the point, not quite on the point, but near the point, somewhere here maybe, and then click and drag. And as you drag, if you now hold the command or the control key down, you'll see that the base of the wall is going to snap to the floor. And that's how easy it is. For example, if you wanted this point to snap around, you click near this point, and then hold down command, and you see that's the point that's going to snap. If I want this point to snap, I click near that point and hold down command, and that's the one that snaps around. So I'm gonna move the wall back to somewhere here. So I'm just gonna click and drag, and then hold the command key down so it snaps. Then I let go of my mouse, then the command key. Let's go and set the rest of this room up. So I'm just gonna create the side walls as well. So for that, I'm gonna go layer, new, solid, and I'm gonna hit okay. And again, we can't see the layer here because it isn't a 3D layer. So we need to convert this into a 3D layer by clicking on this button. I'm going to rotate the layer by pressing W. Then I'll rotate this on the Y axis by holding down the Shift key, by holding down the Shift key, so it locks that rotation to be 45 degrees. And then I'll get my selection tool, V, on the keyboard. I'll then click somewhere near this base point and then drag this up and hold down Command and that snaps as well. And then finally, I'll just go and duplicate this, Command D to duplicate, I'll then move this here with the command key again, so that one snaps as well. And I'm just gonna go and rename these. I'm gonna go call this one right wall, and the one underneath the left wall. And now if I get my camera tool to bring everything down, and then maybe my orbit camera tool to move around, we have ourselves a perfectly lined up 3D room.